It's Mike Adam. This is your eye opener music beat. We are hanging out at North Star Bar. I just yeah. uh, saw Ryan Beatty do his little uh, warm up, man. <laughs> it felt very rocky, kind of, huh? Yeah, definitely. Uh, yeah, I'd say my my sound has definitely turned into something that I've always wanted it to be. It definitely has more of like a a little bit of a rock influence to it. Um, so you had something big the other day. You had a, a birthday. And what I wanted to know, what is the best birthday present you think you've ever given to somebody I've else? I've given to somebody else. Oh, okay. So this last year, uh, my brother, me and my brother are huge fans of Parks and Recreation. Like, that's our favorite show. Okay. Uh, we literally watch it every single day. Like, even episodes that we've seen. We've, we've seen every episode probably, like, ten times. Yeah. Each. yeah. Uh, um... So uh, they did. They were doing this thing called Paley Fest, where uh, all the entire cast gets together and like, it's like they do this panel, right? And uh, so I got tickets to that, and he had no idea, and like, he thought that we were just going to like this improv show, which is we something that we do for fun a lot yeah, yeah. in Los Angeles. And uh, so we go. It was it's like somewhere near, like somewhere in the middle of Hollywood, and uh, we just walk in, and he's like, "Where are we?" And I was like. He had no idea, and he was the most excited. And I feel like it was the perfect present. Like, I've never seen him. I have not seen him that happy in the longest time. <laughs> That's awesome. And the, the best part about it was, like, something that – I mean, I was excited myself to go. Right, right. Um, but they played an episode that was that hadn't even aired yet, so we got to see an episode before. Wow. Like, it even aired, and we were really excited about you that. You were the yeah. best brother ever yeah. that day. He was so excited. Um, before we had this interview, I was like stalking you on YouTube and stuff and, and looking at all your covers because I, I love them all. Uh, you did a great one recently. It was the uh, the Beyonce one, EXO. Oh, yeah, yeah, um, with Ali. Yeah, with, with Ali Simpson, Simpson yeah. Cody's sister. sister. Yeah. How did that come about? Um, I know you're friends with Cody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I mean, I've been friends with Ali, I, I think, just as long as I've been friends with Cody. So, uh it just kind of, I don't even really how, remember how it all came to be, but I mean, we've always talked about maybe doing something together, and uh, that song popped in my head, and I was like, why don't we do this one, and so we got together and did But it. Ryan, I'm going to call you out. I noticed something. The video was on Ali's channel yeah. and not on yours, not on dude. Mine. Were you like, yo, it's not good enough for me. No, I'm no, just no, 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 that's Ali. not it. Uh, I don't even, honestly... I, I don't even know how that conversation happened, but we just decided it should go on her channel. Yeah, yeah. So She's got a lot of hits on it. Yeah, yeah. I feel like people don't know that's like a, a hobby for her almost. And I was looking at some of the comments, and they were like, Ali could sing, you know? Yeah. That's pretty cool. Yeah, she just does it for fun, and I really respect that. That's, that's yeah. pretty cool. She just, yeah. like, puts out a song every, every now and then. So the big question, man, uh, save the best for last the debut album. Tell yes. me what's going on. Do we have so the, the title, year, the date? Yeah, yeah. So this year, I do have a few titles in mind. Um, I'm not going to share them. You, you can't give me like the runner up. What's like the runner up that you know you're not going to uh, go with, but you were close to Well, you know, one it. thing I really uh, was close to, to calling it, but it didn't happen just because <laughs> um, it was actually another artist named, I forgot who, I can't think of the artist's name right now, but I was going to name it Retrograde. That was like a year ago. I, I, that, I had that set in mind, but I, now I think it's going to be something different. So okay. that was just an idea. But um, yes, this year has been, I've really been, uh, you know, focusing so much on, on, on writing. And, uh, you know, I write all the time. I just, have a t I just have been going on my notes on my phone, just putting ideas down and stuff. And this year's really inspired me uh, musically. And I know I've been working on an album for a while, but I have to say, um, I'm very glad that I have not put an album out yet be just because I know that if I would have put an album out, you know, a while back, I not I would have not been happy with it just right, because right. I, d I wasn't in the right place uh, musically, lyrically. I, I just was kind of, you know, not really, I wasn't really putting my... my Spin on it. M yeah, as much as I could have provided, I, d I wasn't providing as much as I should have. Um, I, I wasn't really speaking my mind in the fact that I didn't want to make, you know, really pop music, and uh, I just kind of let people tell me what to do. I guess you could say. Right, right, right. Whereas now I'm very, I'm very um, involved, way more involved in the process. Um, and uh, if I don't like something, I will say no. I'm not. I'm not gonna, you know, do it this. I want to do it this way. Um, so, so when when's the date, man? I don't have a date, but I'm really. 
I'm really, really closer. That's as much as I can say. I'm getting really, really closer, and um, I'm just really happy with it. I'm really, Good. really happy with the music and the sound of it. Ryan sure. Beatty, thank you so much for yeah, having me. Yeah, absolutely. Out, man. Yeah, thanks for talking.